as we begin to conclude this month of November, and as we look forward to December and our new year, let us move in great faith and in the spirit of excellence. May we pray. Gracious Heavenly Father, Lord, we come now thanking you once again for simply being a good God. We thank you for being all that we need. We thank you for being the most high God and an all-sufficient Savior. And now, Lord, as we come, beginning this a new day, give us a renewed freshness so that we are able to carry out the assignments that you have bestowed upon us. Give us a mindset, Lord, to walk by faith and not by sight and to have a, have a spirit of excellence as we go forth into the unknown. We ask you to guide our thinking and to order our steps as we strive to be the best that we can be for you. So, Lord, we ask you, Lord, to simply fall afresh in our hearts. We ask you to give us a heart full of thanksgiving as we conclude this month of November. And we ask you, Lord, to give us a spirit of excellence as we move into this next level of service. Lord, we thank you, Lord, for all that you've done. We thank you for keeping us from dangers both seen and unseen. We thank you for watching us as we travel over the highways and the byways. We thank you for blessing our families. We thank you for blessing our churches. We thank you for blessing our fellowships. And Lord, we ask you, Lord, as we go forth to touch our children, we ask you to keep them safe in this dark world. We ask you to bless those who are sick and those who are shut in. We ask you to bless those, Lord, who are, are struggling in their homes and in their family lives, Lord. And we ask you, Lord, to simply Touch them. Touch them all, Lord, with your spirit, your finger of love, Lord. We ask you to fall afresh in their hearts. And even though they may be struggling on today, let them know that you love them more than anything. Lord, we just thank you for being a good God. We thank you for loving us in spite of ourselves. We thank you for loving us in spite of our thinking, Lord. And we're going to be so careful to give your name the praise, the honor, and the glory because you're good. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory. Forever we pray. Amen, amen, and amen. So I challenge you to go forth from this day forward in the spirit of excellence and in great faith. God bless you.